the world leader hard. Enjoy. I forgot. Alright, Leviathan. This boss has to be tanked by two tanks. Um, the head has to be tanked and the tail has to be tanked. Um, I'll explain the mechanics as they appear. We're just waiting for one of the healers and the other tank. Okay, so the important uh, thing to pay attention to in this fight is going to be you've got a device that you've got to activate. This is the activation thing. Um, this needs to build... Pa it needs to build power in order to be able to survive the boss's um, wipe mechanic. So. I'm gonna sit here. I'm gonna spam my uh, my skill. Boss is gonna dive under the water, and then it's going to do a, a pass. You'll see a sploosh like that, and then it's going to slam. You've got the tail right behind. Ads will spawn. Kill the ads as fast as possible. Since the other tank is not reading chat, I am going to do what I can. I am going to take the tail. Funny, I'm, I'm kind of expecting a wipe here. We'll see. We'll see what happens. We got five people that might know the fight. There we go. We get a wave to come through, and then we've got these gyre spumes. We need to kill. We need to kill these. Because these are draining the energy from the conversion. Even though I'm not. Oh! Now you decide to. Okay. Yes, this is going to be a wipe. We have no power. Okay. When it goes on the long ways, it's going to do a, uh, a charge like that. Okay. It's going to pop up and it's going to slam. We want to kill the spumes. Because with the... There we go. Oh, yep. We do not have enough power to protect ourselves. And it went off too late. Yep. Okay. And I'm going to go through all that again.
All right. Boss does the slam. Hail comes out of the water. The Sahagwin. will pop up. This is kind of not really a DPS race, but um, when the boss hits a certain amount of health, he will, it will uh, start um, other stages. Like, after these two Sahagwin die, he's probably going to dive. Healers will need not stack on each other because they will both be targeted with a uh, AoE. Healers should not be standing on anybody, basically. So, the gyre spumes are going. We're down to about 59%. Okay, we have enough now. Now it is just. crap. You've got to activate the converter for the boss. There we go. Before the boss begins this attack. If the shield goes up after that attack begins, you're going to wipe. You're going to have a bad time. All right. Directional sound works here to figure out where Leviathan is going to be popping up. There will be a few ads that spawn. The ads that spawn here will um, lay down crap on the deck and cause people to run away in fear. There may not be an ad that spawns because of the damage that we're doing. There it is. So, that gets dispatched quickly, and that's going to be a kill. I could have explained that fight better. I was explaining it both on in-game and out. So, watch for the dives so that you can avoid those. Watch for the plume over there, and then run to the opposite side. In the extreme mode of this, there's not going to be any wall. You don't get saved by the, uh, the railing. That was Leviathan. Thank you for watching. I hope you found it informative. If you want to see more Final Fantasy XIV videos, please like follow, and subscribe, the usual YouTube stuff. To catch me live, check out my Twitch, link in the description. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.